What happens when a man from Snowy River marries a girl from Austria? Things get wild. Wild Brumby in Jindabyne is a restaurant and distillery owned and run by locals Brad and his Austrian wife, Monica. So, Brad, how does a boy from the Snowy Mountains end up married to a beautiful lady from Austria, mate? Well, before we get into that, I think we need a little schnapps just to get started. OK, OK, let's do that. There you go. Thank you. A little butterscotch. I'm looking forward to this story now. Cheers. cheers. Oh, thumb on top, finger on the bottom. Like that? Cheers, Matt. Thank you. Cheers, mate. Mmm. Well, Smooth. that's why I met an Austrian girl. Monica's family were making schnapps in Austria. We fell in love in the mountains in Austria. Yep. Monica came out to Australia and she was missing her Austrian schnapps so much, we decided to build a distillery. Wild Brumby isn't just a distillery. There's a restaurant overlooking the grounds and, of course, a schnapps tasting bar. I tasted a new one today, limoncello. How did that go? Amazing. Absolutely love it. Wendy, what flavours did you have today at the tasting? Uh, I had the butterscotch, the yep. limoncello, and um, <laughs> I love that spicy one, the, the tongue. Devil's tongue. The devil's tongue. Devil's tongue. Devil's tongue. Devil's tongue. Now, these guys don't only make schnapps, they make gin as well. Pink gin, Brad. Pink gin. What's going on with the pink gin? Well, Matt, it's pink because we have raspberries in it. Our, we grow the raspberries just over here. Yeah, nice. And uh, that gives the, the pigment comes out of the raspberries and gives it that beautiful pink, pink quality. We also have uh, rose petal and juniper, of course, juniper I can to smell make it. a gin. You can smell and then it. mountain pepperberry, look at that. The distiller, located inside, is the centrepiece of the restaurant, and it's where you can watch the gin and schnapps being made using lots of local produce and traditional methods. Just like the schnapps, the menu here is big on Austrian flavours. What have we got here, Sebastian? Well, we have some traditional dish, yeah, our Austrian spinach and ricotta dumplings. Yum. It's a really famous dish in Austria. Really warming dish. Yeah, we use local ingredients. We use the local spinach from just a farm down the road. Yep. And it's a really popular thing. Great. Well, I'm Everyone looking forward loves to having them. some. Now, um, are you Austrian? Yourself? No, I'm German. I'm German. Yep. But it's close enough, I reckon. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> the dumplings are topped with local spinach and shaved parmesan. There you go, Matt. I reckon that's ready. Dankeschön. Bitte schön. OK, a little <laughs> bit of German. Mm. Did I promise too much? <laughs> Wonderbar. <laughs> Great. The dumplings are sensational. And how's this for dessert? A schnappuccino with a strudel. And make sure you swing by the shop on your way out for some wild brumby schnapps, gin or vodka. It's a taste of Austria right here in the Snowy Mountains, and if you're like me, you'll definitely be taking some home. Get cosy at the Wild Brumby Distillery in the Snowy Mountains. It's open seven days.